What's up, money friends and the viewers of the tube? I'm uh, getting a new headset. I'm actually getting a new microphone. It's pretty badass, but uh, my little mic broke, and I bought these little things, but they only work from a phone. So now I gotta use this silly mic. But let's get into why AI is a scam. So no, I'm not AI, but AI cryptos. Because let's be honest, most of these are trash. They're not doing anything. And why would you ever buy a token that? Uh, buy inferior product. I mean, open, let's just be honest. Google, Microsoft, NVIDIA, uh, OpenAI, Facebook, or Meta, all these companies are going to produce a hundred, a thousand, probably a million times better than anything these AI crypto tokens are going to produce. Because one, uh, the infrastructure is super expensive to run clusters of AI nodes and GPUs and all that is involved. And where is that money going to come from? The token? Where they're going to dump on you and steal your money from investors? Probably. So why would you ever invest in any of these? Most of these are trash anyways. Near protocols are layer zero. So I mean, not AI, probably not even big data. Render, uh, not even big data, sh sharing economy. Uh, what, I, if you get paid, to, I think this is probably the only real use case, but it's not really a web three thing because you could just do that like normally I don't understand like it, it doesn't make sense to me uh, graph not AI like oh let's just open all these up because it's kind of silly that they call all of this uh, AI when really they're not AI um, let's see theta pro golem AOnet. let's check some of them out netmine token pow AI Sleepless AI, LimeWire is not AI. It's just buzzwords, pretty much. So let's check some of these out because you know why not. The built the blockchain built for finance. So not really a uh, crypto project uh, that is AI. It is literally just uh, another blockchain. Um, we have the graph. Uh, upgrade your hosting sub graphs. So the subgraph, uh, not AI, not even big data. So okay, cool. Sminton Soar. That's a fucking weird name. Pioneering the digital insurance, uh, the artificial intelligence. Okay, so just probably just copy like. So nothing, I, literally nothing. I mean, it's just a website with a fake data search and a bunch of bullshit is pretty much what it comes down to. Um, Theta Network, which used to be like peer-to-peer -peer video, it is now doing AI, so they don't even know what they're doing. Um, are they going to do anything? Probably not, to be honest. Uh, Like, what the fuck is this? Like, at American Idol, we are constantly challenging ourselves to be the emperor of innovation with innovative NFT trading celebrities. This is... What? Oh, my God. It's just sad. Let's check out some Fetch AI. Another AI that's not going to do anything. Build, deploy, and monetize AI services. Which they probably just use um, open AI's... Um, API. Let's see if they have any agents that we can use right now. Continue with agent first AI. So, what is, okay. So, nothing there. Okay, so they have nothing is what it, it comes down to. Because what is this? They can't even use, I, I have no idea. So a fake website, pretty much. Like nothing that I could use, essentially. My first agent. I don't know, it's stupid. It's probably just a, like AI built with uh, GPTs that are agents and that won't actually do anything. It's more like a chatbot, I, 
I think. Uh, let's see, what is uh, Singularity Net IO? Expanding the AI and AG ecosystem. Let's view their ecosystem. Wow, so cool. They are doing so much. Um, let's see, what technology, what, what do they have? A loyalty system. Oh my god. Technology platform. So, okay, explore if Dainese, diverse AI features. Demo AI service for free. Me, make it your AI. Multiple pricing options. Okay, let's check this out. The AI marketplace. All this stuff could be easily like fixed with, uh, or you wouldn't even have to pay anything. You can just use ChatGPT or Claude or um, you know any of the other like systems that are out there and all these get like three stars two stars like they're all pretty garbage and why would you spend they're probably made up too but um yeah all these are garbage like why would you use any of them i guess mine would uh this is hate speech i guess my hate speech on this platform uh of how this plop this uh singularity net is garbage is um would be text detected but let's keep going the ecosystem we already went over that it seems like they are like doing nothing proposal five percent of tokens minted each month are allocated so uh essentially they are creating super inflation seems pretty uh pretty sweet io.net the internet of gpus is finally here Let's see what their workers are. They want me to log in. Okay. I can't see their products without logging in. Uh, so they're cloud computing software, maybe? Cloud. So they're like a render, I guess? I mean, they have a pretty site, but. I mean, do you really need uh, crypto for this? Probably not. I don't know too much. I mean, I can't. I'm not going to install any of these because I don't know what they do. Um, but it seems like something that is easily done by already in OpenAI with GPTs. Um, there are agents software out there that doesn't require you to pay uh, in crypto. So I mean, they're not really solving anything. Netmind token. Training, fine tuning, and inference. The decentralized machine learning and AI platform. None of these are decentralized. I don't understand where, I mean, they're not. 99% not, of crypto is not decentralized. It's, it's made up bullshit that people keep saying. So, train AI and rent GPU rewards, machine learning, blah, blah, blah. Like, all these companies are going to go under. They're not going to be around next next bull run. So I don't know why you would ever invest in any of these. I mean, you, sh you might get a quick pump because they might do something with a, a partnership and blah, blah, blah. Here's a chatbot, um, which, I mean, you can, well, I don't know why you would pay for the chatbot when you can just use ChatGPT for free. Seems like a, a waste. You can stake it, I guess, and get a whole 15% in your wallet. That seems pretty pretty sweet. With uh, I mean, if you got in early in some of these, then you made some great money. But um, I'm more about, I don't really care about the money. I'm more about actually technology and all these technologies that I've seen in crypto are a bunch of bullshit. Okay. So this is a relationship app. Him at Genesis Test is coming. This is weird. Uh, what sleepless AI? What do they do? It's a gaming platform. 
revolutioning the gaming industry with its unique approach and extended ex uh, experience of the team. Our mission is to offer unparalleled emotional support and immersive gaming experiences through AI companion games. Oh my god, what is going on with this? Love him, love her. So it's like a sex game, is what it seems like. You dress him up, feed him, and play with him, customize him. So it's like a Tamagotchi pet, pet that's like human AI. You have human AI pets that are humans. Seems pretty sweet. Cool. Well, there you go. There's your AI roundup for amazing crypto projects that are doing nothing um, and will probably fail in the next. I don't know, a couple bull runs. I mean, these top ones, these top like here, gonna appear rather, eh, probably top 100. Like even them, like Fetch AI is not gonna be around, so let's take that off. Theta, they have some big partnerships, but you know, we'll see. Um, I don't know if the, the, the graph, maybe injection, no. Render, no. Near protocol, maybe because it's a blockchain layer zero, but they're not building anything really on there. Um, so there's that. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Is AI crypto the good invest? I mean, it's not an invest. When I think of investing, I think of I'm investing in a project for the long term and they're, they're building something because of it and it's going to grow. Not a uh, crypto project that uses the money to, as a startup, to hope that something comes and they're able to achieve something. And uh, like, we're not, I feel like the crypto, crypto AI and all this went from self-funding startups to requiring investors to invest into these projects as like angel investors and they don't really care about if you lose your money they just want to hopefully make their scam project uh, make money like you're pretty much all these projects are just funding possible startups is what it is so take that as you will I wouldn't invest in any of these they're all garbage to me I would rather use Claude. I mean, it's, it's way better. Claude, uh, ChatGPT. I mean, pretty, pretty good stuff. Anyways, that's it, guys. Peace.